So today we bring you Flu Vaccine 101. Flu Vaccine 101. Now, have you ever gotten the flu vaccine, but you still got the flu? How can that happen? It's because the flu virus is super sneaky and incredibly interesting. Flu vaccine works like this. You get the vaccine and then you start building antibodies and after about two weeks, you have enough antibodies that are going to help you protect your body against the flu virus. Seems pretty simple. Now, there are two ways most people go about getting the vaccine. One, you get an injection. Flu shot. Not bad. It's dead virus, and that's what helps you build up the immunity. Two, you could get a nose spray. It actually has attenuated virus, which is just a weakened form of the flu virus. There's not just a flu virus. There are lots and lots and lots of flu viruses. You're not gonna have a flu shot that will combat every virus. So if you do get a flu shot, you still could potentially get a virus from one that wasn't um, developed in this flu shot. How do you know what virus to put in the vaccine? Trick question. There are actually three viruses. You have to forecast and predict on a worldwide scale every year which are gonna be the most common influenza viruses in each of the clades. So the World Health Organization has um, researchers and scientists who's actually been studying a lot of these viruses for many years. And some of them, um, when they studied them, realized that they actually originated in Asia. And so that's a lot of times why we go to Asia now to see which potential viruses um, are gonna be problematic. And those are the ones that we wanna make the vaccines for. So you have thousands of viruses, but you can only choose three that are going to go into the vaccine. So you want to choose not just the most common viruses, but you want to choose viruses that have a lot in common genetically with other influenza viruses. So that if you get another virus that's similar to the one of the ones that's in the vaccine, you still have antibodies that are going to help you fight it. Pretty neat. Cross protection. <laughs> So the flu virus, and I'm talking all influenza viruses, originally come from birds. If you're really healthy, you got a good immune system and you get the flu, you're, you're gonna pull through. But every once in a while there's a flu strain that is not like the others. Like the 1918 flu epidemic. The 1918 flu epidemic killed 50 million people. And oddly, the people with the strongest immune systems were the most vulnerable in that case. Getting the flu, no good. Studying the flu, right up there. If you like what we're doing, of course we got more videos up here to watch and you can subscribe to our feed.